Greetings to you, our esteemed viewers. I welcome you to today's episode of Sutin Springs, our weekly Lenten reflection. Rejection from family and friends is a painful experience that can leave a deep emotional scar. Unfortunately, it is a common experience that many people have faced at some point in their lives. In our world today, rejection has taken different forms and shades. Worthy of note, however, is the rejection that comes to us as a result of the faith that we profess in Jesus Christ. In our readings today, we are being presented with the theme of rejection. Of all the rejections that have been experienced throughout the ages, one stands out above all the rest. It is the rejection of the Son of God. Joseph was rejected by his brothers who sold him into slavery as seen in our first reading taken from the book of Genesis chapter 37 verses 3 to 4, 12 to 13, 17 to 28. In the gospel reading according to Matthew chapter 21 verses 33 to 43, Jesus in a parable foretell how he will be rejected by the Jews and the Roman officials. Dear friends in Christ, the big question here is, do we also reject Christ by refusing conversion and the commandments of God? What is our commitment towards the Lenten pillars of prayer, fasting and alms given? Since the season of Lent offer us the opportunity to come closer to Christ, we are reminded, therefore, to reject sin and all worldly pleasures that will hinder us from getting closer to our God. In this journey of faith, may God equip us with His grace and strength to be able to conquer our weaknesses and limitations so that we can grow in virtues and holiness and not reject Him by our sinful lifestyle. 